the new Volvo Warrington, a Volvo V70R, all wheel drive, bit of a rare thing this. Just down the bottom of the front bumper, on the black, we've got some uh, paint missing here, obviously nothing too bad and then light stone chipping on the bottom. Just across the driver's side, a little bit of blister on the lacquer, but nothing too bad. And then, as usual, you get your odd little stone chip or two on the bonnet areas. This car has got a couple of chips in the windscreen, it's got three. One driver's side there, and then two to the passenger side, one lower by the wipers, and one there just by the uh, above the dash. in very good condition for its price. Car has believe that. Alloy wheels need a little bit of refurbing around the edges. The car's got four good tyres on it, four mil all round. Just again by the load area. Got a little bit of a circle mark there and a tiny bit of scuffing just there. The car's got detachable tow bar fitted as well. And we're missing the uh, the V off the uh, the V70 badge. Our parts department on the left of us. I'm sure they, uh, they will welcome the business. And again, the car itself, I'd say front passenger side alloys, probably your worst. Very clean. Complete with a detachable tow bar stroke weapon. Okay, so in the back of the car, leather interior. It's a lovely blue, black tinge uh, leather. Um, very clean, no, no damage. Okay, so just on the driver's seat on the edge there, a little bit of wear on the outer. To be fair, there ain't much more than that in this car. So V70R manual, heated seats, dual zone climate control, usual uh, toys. Car's done 140,100 miles. Three owners in total. Again, comes complete with two keys. The car's got a fairly comprehensive service history. It's got 12 dealer stamps and one non-franchise stamp. One non -franchise stamp. The car was last serviced on the 13th of August last year, 2012, and the car was at 131,230 miles. MOT on this car is until the 15th of August 2013. last service last year was actually done by our good selves.